Welcome to this episode of Mommy C Star. Well, okay, so there's been a second assassination attempt on Donald Trump today. And it happened while we were visiting, nice quiet visit with my grandma and parents. And you must excuse my daughter because she's excited and she's giggling a lot. And I want to get this video out because this second attempt happened today and I thought, you know what, we really need to get serious. All the Christians need to start praying because this is out of control. Our country is in such a mess, a mess, a mess. And so we're going to pray. This is a Catholic prayer from Father Chad Ripperger, who is a well-known exorcist, and he has composed this prayer to consecrate the election to our Blessed Mother. I'm going to read it to you. I'm hoping it's going viral. It's on a lot of websites everywhere, not just my little channel. And I just hope that it's getting out everywhere. So let's pray this prayer together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Mary Immaculate, Living Tabernacle of the Divinity, where the eternal wisdom lies, hidden to be adored and served by angels and men, Queen of heaven and of earth, beneath whose sway are subject all things that are lower than God, patroness of the United States of America, sorrowful and mindful of our own sinfulness and the sins of our nation, we come to be our refuge and hope, knowing that our country cannot be saved by our own works and mindful of how much our nation has departed from the ways of thy son. We humbly ask that thou wouldst turn thine eyes upon our country to bring about its conversion. We consecrate to thee the integrity of the upcoming election and its outcome so that what is spiritually and morally best for the citizens of our country may be accomplished and that all of those who are elected would govern according to the spiritual and moral principles which will bring our nation into conformity with the teachings of thy son. Give grace to the citizens of this land so that they will choose leaders according to the sacred heart of thy son that his glory may be made manifest lest we be given the leaders we deserve trusting in the providential care of god the father and thy maternal care we have perfect confidence that thou wilt take care of us and will not leave us forsaken O mary immaculate pray for us amen in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen and that's a pretty chaotic reading of the beautiful prayer but my daughter is with me all always she's my responsibility and so i want to get this prayer out as quickly as possible let's pray it every day until the election because we really need mother mary's intercession just like she interceded at the wedding feast of Cana that brought about Christ's first public miracle because she asked him and he said woman what would you have of me my time is not yet come and she told the servers the five word prayer mother Teresa would hold up her hand and it means do whatever he tells you and so that's why we entrust our nation to the care and the intercession of our Blessed Mother. So let's pray this every day until the election and may God have mercy on our country.